Hi y'all, welcome back to my channel. So today I thought that we could do something a little bit fun and play with some crayons, maybe explore these specialty crayons just a little bit and swatch some of them out. I don't really know where I'm going with this video quite yet, but I think it will be fun. And I had posted a video the other day. I did it as a shorts, it was under a minute because I was in the Dollar Tree and I found these really cool uh, eight packs of crayons. Of course, they were only a dollar each and I was able to get six packs there. And then after I did that, I went to Walmart and I was able to find some other colors at Walmart and to look at these colors of kindness. They're just like, they look like they're pastel colors, but at the Dollar Tree, there was a pastel set. So I would like to explore these and see if these are the same or if they are different from one another. I have not opened the packages. I've not looked at any of them yet. I wanted to be able to do that on camera so that I could share all of this with all of you. This set here, I purchased from Amazon quite a while ago and I really love this set. And you all know we have to just collect all of the things and crayons are just a classic because we grew up with crayons and they're just fun. So this is $14.88 right now on Amazon and it is 152 crayons. It's called the Ultimate Crayon Collection and it comes with this little sharpener in here. I did use these a little bit and color with them a little while ago, but I've just been so busy I've not had more time to explore these a little bit more, but I thought it was really cool because they all come in their own space and it's pretty good quality and then you get this little sharpener here. So we're going to look at these today, so if you would like to see that, stick around. If you check the description box below, you will find links down there for for my email list, my Facebook group. I would love for you to join us over there. And you will also find links for my Etsy store and my Patreon if you would like to support me there. Let's go ahead and check out these crayons. Okay, so I'm gonna move these off to the side, this big, huge set, because this is, and I wanna say too, I'm not sure if these colors that are here these specialty sets, I'm not sure if they match up to any of the colors in here, so I'd like to go ahead and check that out a little bit. Maybe we'll do a little bit of that as we explore these and see if any of them match up to the colors here. But I'm going to push this one off to the side because this is what I wanted my video to focus on. Just all these really cool specialty sets, and I think there's more that I've not been able to get my hands on because when I went to Walmart, this glitter set, I'm gonna check other Walmarts because these seem really, really fun, but this glitter set right here, this was the very last set and it was like stuck behind something to where I had to really dig to get it. Like I was looking through all of the crayons and moving things around because they said on the app that there were things in stock, but they were not there. And then I was really surprised to find this set this was the very last one of this too, and I was really excited to find these. So as far as pricing goes, this set here, I believe I paid $1.27 for. This set here, I paid $1.20 for, and then these were a little bit more expensive. These were $2.97 a piece. And I believe there is also these neons right here that I found in an eight pack, which I wanted to get the 24 pack. I could not find them at Walmart. Their app says they have them, but there is a 24 set available. So I do know that I'm going to be searching for those because I really want the 24 set. And look at these, how cool. Pastel crayons. I thought that was really super, super cool, but I wanted to be able to swatch a little bit of these today and then see how many of them match up to this big, huge set because I am just really curious and I thought that this would be a really fun video to do. I am really excited to swatch those glitter ones because I want to be able to see if there is actually, if the glitter comes off onto the page because I think that would be super, super cool and then these confetti ones, they look really neat too. So let's go ahead and take a look at these. I think we all know about the colors of the world. You all know that I've done uh, quite a few videos on the colors of the world products. I don't have the markers. I did a video where I showed you how to color skin and I used the color of colors of the world uh, 
colored pencils because y'all know that's what my channel is all about, colored pencils. Okay, so I just grabbed this swatch sheet here. This is my 72 swatch sheet that I have um, available in my Etsy store. I'll have the link down below for this swatch chart if you're interested in that. But this one is really great because you could put the numbers and the names for your colored pencils. But I wanted to be able to have some kind of rhyme or reason to this. So I just grabbed this swatch chart and I'm gonna go ahead and swatch my crayons on here. Although these are not gonna have numbers. I think that they all have names though, which is really super cool. Okay y'all, so I just decided to call Crayola and talk to them to get all of the info on these crayons. <laughs> And it looks like I am going to go back to Walmart and see if I could find other sets that apparently were out of stock because from what they tell me, these are really, really popular and a lot of times they're hard to find. So the metallic and the pearl, I only have the eight count sets, but both of these are available in 24. And so they should be, I'm gonna see if I could find them at a Walmart somewhere. I have a feeling these pearls are gonna be really difficult to find because I didn't see them on the Walmart app. I'm gonna check Amazon too, but I don't think these are available on Amazon. I'll have to double check on that. But the neons also, like I said earlier, these are available in 24. So the neon, the pearl, and the metallic, all are available in a 24 set. And then these Cosmic Crayons, these were a Dollar Tree exclusive. So you can only get these at Dollar Tree if you could find them. I know some Dollar Trees have them, other Dollar Trees do not. And I think that she said that the pastels are only available in this eight count set as well. And then the colors, or the um, Colors of Kindness Crayons, these are brand new and they are only available in this 24 set. So these are brand new, they just came out. They're super, super cute. You could see the colors here on the side. I'm not sure how well they match up, but they've got on all of the 24 packs, they got 24 um, or 12 colors on one side and then the other 12 colors on the other side. And these I assume are gonna be kind of lighter colors, like maybe more pastel-y colors, at least that's the way that they look. And then it says here, introducing four, four colors. So I'm not sure exactly what that means because she said these were brand new. So I think, which I didn't ask her about this, I'll have to look, but this huge set here, the 100 and, what did I say, 152 set, this set does come with your metallics, and your glitter. So in here, you've got 16 glitter over here on this end. So you've got 16 glitter here. And then over here on this end, we have the metallic ones. So these are 16 metallic. And then after they came out with this, then they came out with these uh, 24 sets. So when you purchase this 24 set of glitter crayons, you are going to get duplicates of what you would get in here. And in this pack, you're getting eight extra crayons. So there's eight new colors in here and it is the same for the metallic, but I was not able to find the 24 set of metallics. So this set here, this eight metallic crayons, I probably have duplicates of the same colors in here in these metallics here. I believe these, yeah, see these say metallic on them. So I've got the same colors in here as I have in here, but I just have extra colors here, an extra eight colors. And then the 24 pack will have an extra eight colors on top of that. So it will have the new colors in it. And then if I look through some of these other ones, these just look like your regular crayons. So this set consists of the 120 pack of crayons that come in the big box but they are also giving you the metallics and the glitter crayons, which makes up the 32 extra crayons from the 120 set, which are right here and right here. So this right here, 
these are the glitter ones and then over here on this side these are the metallic ones so i hope that explains it good enough for those of you that were curious and like to just collect all of the things i'm that way too <laughs> and i love my crayons so for this video i think that i'm just going to we're going to explore some of these different colors i really want to see the colors in the colors of the world so let me put these in some kind of order how i want to be able to swatch them out and i'm not going to swatch the big huge set of course because that would just take way too long for this video <laughs> but I wanna swatch some of these um, specialty ones. Okay, so how about we start with the newest set, which is this Colors of, um, Colors of Kindness. So I'm gonna to have to find out, introducing four new colors, I don't know exactly what that means by four new colors because if it came in another set, well, look how cute this packaging is. So it says, hello, sunshine, cray yellow, peace of mind, cool mint, Sky's the Limit Powder Blue, a warm hug oatmeal. That is That oatmeal color is very different. Is that, maybe it's like a gray, but you can see here, and I'll go over some of the colors. So we've got Go With The Flow, A Slice Of Nice, Life Is Gouda, <laughs> that's cute, Warm And Fuzzy, You're So Appealing, <laughs> Hello Sunshine, Keep Moving Forward, Kind To The Core, Peace Of Mind, Seize The Day, and then of course Seize is S-E-A-S, Lucky to know you, ride the waves, and then if we turn it over, we've got spread your wings, breathe deep, always brave, a warm hug, sky's the limit, spring into action, rise above, best buddies, nurture nature, heart to heart, be sweet to each other, have a scoop of fun. Now, if y'all don't buy this for any other reason, <laughs> get to a Walmart and pick this up just because... It looks like the colors are pretty pastel. They really do. These are some really pretty colors. And then the names. I mean, can the names be any better? <laughs> so let's just go ahead and lay these out. And I'm just going to lay some of these colors down so we can see. I'm not good. They're not going to be in any kind of certain order. And it doesn't look like they're all pastels. There are other colors in here that are quite dark so i guess they save the pastels for the actual pastels but this is go with the flow and then this one is spread your wings what a pretty color and then we've got have a scoop of fun so that's like a pinky red color and then what is this one this just says peach oh warm and fuzzy Oh, and then that's funny. It says peach down here at the end, but then it says warm and fuzzy here. But I was told that these are not duplicate colors by Crayola. So I don't know, we'll have to see, but I don't think that they are. I think this is a completely new set. Ride the waves. So we've got ride the waves. And then we've got a green here. It actually says shamrock here. And then it says, lucky to know you. I hope that these aren't just repackaged and given different names, but that's not what she told me on the phone. Supposedly they are new, so I'll just have to believe whatever they say. <laughs> so spring into action. And I'm not gonna write down any of the names. I just wanted you all to be able to see the colors. A slice of nice. And then we're gonna go back down here and we've got sky's the limit. I got crayons rolling all over the place, y'all. And then we've got, what is this one? Rise Above. These have the coolest names. Kind to the core, oh, I love that. And then we have Inchworm. Okay, so Inchworm is what it says the color is, but then it's got Keep Moving Forward. Oh, that's a pretty color. Oh, look at that. Typical crayons. A little bit of the darker colors uh, streaked out there out of that lighter color. Uh, what is this one? Sea green or seize the day is what they're calling it in this set. So this one is hello sunshine. Look at that beautiful bright orange. And then we have heart to heart. This one here is be sweet to each other. And I'm not trying to be neat or anything. I'm just trying to lay the colors down. <laughs> 
<laughs> you're so appealing and then this one is a warm hug does that look like a warm hu warm hug y'all <laughs> i don't think so <laughs> life is gouda i love the name on this one life is gouda and then we have breathe deep peace of mind and then always brave so this is nurture nature and i am using the spring hill paper because i figure that'll be really good for these pencils since they're so waxy um pencils did i say pencils crayons since they're so waxy best buddies i'm so used to saying pencils y'all you all would be amazed at how many times i film a video and then i say pencils instead of marker or pencils instead of something else it's crazy <laughs> just because I'm usually always doing videos about pencils. So these are colors of kindness. And let me see how I'm going to do this. I'm just going to put colors of kindness up here. So I know which set that is. And then I'm just going to put a little thing right here so I know what those are. Okay, so that set comes with some really pretty colors. And they do look pretty pastel. So they've got some, yeah, these are really beautiful. I really love these. Look at this gorgeous green here. And then this other really light green is really, really pretty. These are really pretty colors. The only one that seems rather dark is this green here. So yeah, I really love those. How about we do the confetti set now? And I don't think that this confetti set is in that big 152 set. And look at the, oh, that one is pretty smashed. Oh, well. <laughs> I had opened up one of the other ones. I think it was the metallic crayons. And I had one that was pretty broken already, but we all know that crayons break. How many of you have kids that have crayons? Oh, look how pretty these are. <laughs> Oh my gosh, they have pink wrappers. I love this. So how many of you have kids that you go, you know, have to keep like replacing their crayons because you go to their crayon box and they're just all broken in pieces. I can't even count how many times I've had to replace my kids crayons just for that reason. And of course my grandkids do the same thing. So we're just going to go ahead. Oh, let's look at the names. Did these have names? These don't have the names on the side. So let's see if they have the names on the pencil or oh, I did it again. Let's see if they have the names on the crayons. It says confetti down here and the wrappers are really, really pretty. They're pink with this silver on top. It looks like it says meteor shower. So yeah, they have colors. This one is called meteor shower and I'll try to call out the names as I swatch them. So we're just going to start swatching these here. Oh, look okay that's crazy oh my goodness so there's like different colors that come out of here and they color like confetti that is so cool this one is winter gala oh my goodness can you all see that let me zoom you in just a little more okay i'll try to make sure i stay in frame here but these are the coolest ever pool party look at the different colors that come out of there this one is Garden Soiree. Look at that, oh my gosh. So look at the tip. This crayon looks like it is literally white. And look at the color that comes out, like greens and blues. That is so neat. So this one is Sunset Luau. Oh my gosh, so it's like a brown with like orange and red in it. And then this one here is called New Year's Eve. Oh, I can't imagine, what's this one gonna be? <gasps> look at that, that, it, oh my gosh. That is so cool. How do they even do that? Look, it looks white and it's purple and pink. Oh my gosh, y'all don't even need to blend your uh, colors together. You just pull out these and they're already blended. Okay, so this one is Weed Jubilee or Tweed. Tweed Jubilee, I think it says. So this one's like a bright green and it looks like it has red and green and orange in it. This one is At the Circus. Oh, that is so cool. It actually looks like a circus. Look at that. This, these are so different. I did not imagine that they were actually going to color and look like confetti. That is just, I don't know, mind blown. <laughs> okay, so this one says Rose Parade. So let's swatch this one. That one has like some reds and some browns and I don't know, like, yeah, different reds, like different shades of red. This one is Mermaid Pageant. Oh, I can't wait to see this one. 
Mermaid Pep. <gasps> Look at that. That is so cool. Okay, so this one is Carnival Corn. That's pretty. This one, look at these, they all look white, but they don't go down on the paper white. This is so neat. Blizzard Blast. Oh, that is cool. It's like white and blue mixed together. This one is Party Fish. <laughs> That's interesting. Oh my goodness. Okay, and then this one is Magenta Fiesta. Magenta Fiesta. <laughs> That's pretty. That one's really pretty. It's like a... I don't know, like a pinky purple, and then it's got like some hot pink in there. This one is called Spring Break. Oh, that's really cool. So this is like brighter greens with like darker greens and medium greens. And then this one is called Raindrops. I keep having to move this over because I'm zoomed in so close. Oh, that is cool. So that's like a blue with reds in it. And then it's got like some lighter teal color blues in there. This one, look at my crayons rolling all over the place. Okay, so this one is called Summertime. See what that looks like. Ooh, that is pretty. That's like, oh my gosh, it's got like peach and pink and purple and blue. This one is called Birthday Child. That is pretty too. Look at that. Oh my goodness. This one is, what does that say? Oh my gosh, I can't even read that one. Something bake, clean, clam bake. It says clam bake. Let's see what this looks like. Oh, that is neat. Oh my gosh, and like, dependent upon how you like lay the color down, like different colors all of a sudden come out. Okay, and this one is my one that looks a little smushed and it came like that, but this one's called Cupcake Sprinkles. Oh, is this broken? It feels a little weak. Okay, so that's Cupcake Sprinkles. This one is a little bit broken too, and this one is called Lima Palooza. So this is Lima Palooza. That's beautiful. And then this one is 4th of July. Oh, that is so pretty. It's like red, white, and blue. <laughs> These are like, lay them down and surprise. <laughs> this one is Campfire Jamboree. Oh, that's neat. That looks really cool. It actually looks like a campfire. Oh, this is, this is just like so creative. And it's fun to just lay the colors down and you've, it's like, surprise <laughs> so flamingo festival that is so pretty okay y'all i love those i really really love those and i love the uh paper that's wrapped around them and i love how they're just like a surprise of colors when you lay them down i think that's crazy how these actually look white but you lay them down and they are a completely different color and not even just one color, but like numerous colors in one crayon. That is so super cool. I should have gone and written all of these down, but I'll worry about that later because I really want to be able to use these crayons and color something. Sometimes I just like to sit down and color um, with crayons just because, I don't know, it's just, it brings you back to your childhood and just, I don't know, it's just the relaxing and brings you happiness and just... You know, you don't have to sit there and focus on blending your um, your pencils together and whatever. And I mean, of course, you could do that with your colored pencils as well and just, you know, lay them down on the paper and just straight color without worrying about blending all the colors together. And that is really relaxing too. or sit down and color something like a mandala and that is super relaxing but it's a lot of fun just to sit down and color with crayons sometimes so next i have the glitter crayons set and they are in the regular crayola box and they don't have the colors listed on either one of the sides so i'm going to just call out the names again as i swatch these out so y'all know exactly what I'm laying down. But if we look at these, you can see that they are a little bit different because they've got the silver writing on top of this really pretty blue wrapper, just like the uh, confetti ones had that beautiful pink wrapper. I really like how they change the wrapper for these specialty sets. I think that's really neat. So this color is called Maroon Mist. Oh my gosh, it's so scratchy. Ah because of the glitter. Now I wanted to be able to see if the glitter actually lays down from these glitter pencils or if they're a doozy. <laughs> We're gonna find out because I don't see, like it's just like scratchy where the glitter is, but I don't see the glitter. Is that a piece of glitter? I think there was like one little piece of glitter 
that came out but look at the tip of this I don't know if you can see that but you could see the glitter in the crayon oh look at it sparkling on the camera with my lighting <laughs> but you could actually see the glitter so that's neat but this one is called golden dust oh yeah they are oh I see the some of the glitter coming out but the glitter makes them a little bit scratchy. This one is called Fire in the Sky. And I don't like that scratchy feeling when you lay these down. This one is Wild Wasabi. <laughs> Again, the names are really, really creative and cool. This one is Tropical Shower. And y'all know how much I love glitter. I just really wanted to see some glitter. I'm gonna let me lay just a little bit like a couple layers down here. And I don't really see the glitter. Okay, this one is called Diamond Dazzle. Now, Diamond Dazzle, you better have some glitter here for me. <laughs> I don't see it. Here we have Lavender Burst. And I'm gonna have to, um, after I lay all these down, we'll sort of pick up the paper and turn it to see if we could get a little a bit of that reflective glitter from the crayons. This is Crimson Clash, because maybe I'm just not seeing the glitter. I see the glitter escaping from, oh, I see more of it. So yeah, I see the glitter, especially, oh yeah, I see there's some glitter right there. But it looks like, I don't know if the glitter is staying actually down on the paper. So we will have to see after I get all the colors laid down and swatched out. This one is called Red Slaw. Then we have Aqua Fizz. They definitely have some cool names, but don't all the Crayola products all have really cool names? Now, this one I see a lot of glitter coming out, but it looks again like the glitter is just sort of laying there on the paper and not actually sticking to the paper. So this one is Poppin' Purple. <laughs> this one is Gritty Green. Is that for real? Yeah, Gritty Green. That's interesting. I don't know if I like that name. <laughs> We're calling glitter gritty. <laughs> That's kind of weird because they feel a little like, you know, gritty when they lay down. Blue blazes. But, you know, we can't complain because these are crayons. So this one is chocolate sprinkles. So look at this. You could actually see the glitter in the crayon. That is really neat. And it looks like it goes right down the center. And that's probably why they feel a little... Um, you know, scratchy or r what would be a really good word like gritty <laughs> when they lay down. So this one is Flamingo Flame. Yeah, right when I hit that glitter is when I start to feel that, but I'm not seeing a lot of the glitter again laying down onto the paper. So we've got black gold. Is the glitter going to be gold inside the crayon? They're calling it gold, but if I look at this, it doesn't look like the glitter is gold. It looks like it's all silver glitter. Actually, it does kind of look gold. I don't know if y'all can see that, but it does look gold. That is very neat. Okay, so look at, oh, so this one, look, you could see all the glitter lay down on here, but oh, it's actually laid down. I see it, and it did actually stick to the paper, okay. So we've got Confetti Sunset. So let's lay down this Confetti Sunset. We've got seven more now. So we're getting to the end of this set. And then here we've got Gray Glam. So let's lay down this Gray Glam. Then we have, what is this one? Sun Shower. That's really, pr oh, look at all the glitter escaping this one. That is really cool. So Sun Shower. Then we have Silver Sparks, and that one has a lot of glitter coming out of it as well. Oh wow, look, that one has a lot of glitter in it. This one is Campfire Flicker. We, I remember we had another one that was Campfire something or other, Campfire Blaze or something like that. This one has a lot of glitter in it too. Then we have, this one is called Night Sky. So let's go ahead and swatch out this Night Sky. And then I'm trying to go a little bit faster here. So we've got Orchid Explosion. And then this swatch chart worked perfectly because they come in sets of 24 and I've got eight going across here too. So that's perfect for the eight sets. This one, this is called Shredded Cheddar. <laughs> oh, wow. <laughs> that's a very interesting name. So they're all swatched out. Let me go ahead and hold these closer to the camera 
and turn them a little bit to see if you could actually see the glitter. I don't know, can y'all see it? I don't really see it. Like, they're not glittering or anything. Maybe I'm expecting too much because they are crayons, but if I turn them, I don't see any kind of reflection. Like, I could see the glitter laying there. Maybe if I hold it the other way. So, if I hold it downwards like this, y'all really can't see. But if I hold it downwards like this, I can see. Oh, see, now I could see a lot of the glitter. But it's going to be hard for y'all to see on camera, I think. Because when I hold it down like this and the lighting is hitting it from this direction, like my camera lighting and such, it is actually showing and giving off quite a bit of reflection. So that is really neat. But if I lay it down flat like that, I, I could see the glitter laying there, but you don't see that reflection at all. So here's all the colors so far from the sets that we have swatched. So we've got the 24 Colors of Kindness, the 24 Confetti, and the 24 Glitter, and I've just marked them off on my swatch sheet so I can see what each one of those sets consists of. And I've got another swatch chart here ready to do these last few um colors and i don't think that i'm going to swatch out the colors of the world i don't know maybe i should should i swatch out the colors of, yeah let's go ahead and swatch those out so let's go ahead and go over the names so we've got median medium almond i think these are probably the same names as what you've seen in my um review of the colors of the world colored pencils but medium almond medium deep rose light medium almond these are definitely the same names light medium rose light almond light rose light medium golden very light almond light golden very light rose very light golden extra light almond and then over here we have the darker skin tones we've got deeper almond extra deep golden extra deep rose extra deep almond very deep almond deep golden medium deep golden deep almond very deep rose deep rose medium deep almond and medium golden so this one looks like the regular crayon sets but of course it's got the names going down the sides i don't know why they didn't do that with the others because they totally could have and like the um, kindness set, that is just completely different packaging, which is really pretty. Okay, so these two have the special different colored wrapper on the outside, and it's kind of like this brown color up here and fades into like a lighter, I guess like peachy type or tan color. And they are really cool, but they don't have the metallic writing. They just got a really pale, pale like off-white writing on them and then say the colors of the world. So let's go ahead and swatch some of these out and I will read them off as I go. And I'm gonna try to start with the lighter ones and sort of, um, yeah, I'm going to try to pick up the lighter ones and then move into the darker ones. So we've got extra light almond. Then we have very light almond, very light golden. These are so, so light. You could probably barely see them on camera. This one's pretty light. This is light rose. That's a pretty color. And then here's another rosy looking one. This is very light rose. And yeah, this is light almond, so it probably should have gone down here. Let's move into the medium tones here and get a little bit darker. So this is light golden. So let's swatch out this light golden. We have light medium almond light medium almond we've got another really pretty rosy color so this is light medium rose okay so then we have let me see let's go a little bit darker with the rose color so this is medium deep rose and then we have what is this medium golden i'm going to try to get through these a little bit faster here's another one that's sort of like a medium color this is light medium golden let's lay that one down and then a lot of them are much darker. Let me go with the lightest one. So this is medium almond. Let's go ahead and lay down this medium almond. And then we have medium deep golden. That one's really pretty. That's a really pretty brownish, like it's got a little bit of yellow in it. And then we have deep golden. So this one is just a bit deeper. There's medium deep almond. I'm trying to go in order here, but they're probably going to be very out of order. So deep almond. And then we have, let's go with this one here. This one is deep rose. So that is kind of rosy, but it's very, very brown. 
And then we have, this one is probably a rose color. Yep, very deep rose. So this is the next one up. And then I'm gonna go with this one here. This is very deep almond. Then I am going to go with, this looks like, a, oh no, this is an almond. So extra deep almond. And then we have extra deep golden. This one is extra deep rose. Okay, I thought we were done with the roses. So this one's extra deep rose. And then the last one is deepest almond. That one's really dark. That's a really pretty dark brown. Okay, so here are all of our colors of the world. I think you can, I think those are all in frame, but that's all of our colors of the world. Now we've got a couple eight packs left and y'all, this video is gonna be so long because I did not think I was gonna be doing all of this today. <laughs> but I am just, I really wanna see the colors that are in these sets. And I don't think that I'm going to, well, yeah, I guess I could swatch out the neons. I really wanna look for the 24 set of neons and I know it's available at uh, Walmart but I guess I'll just go ahead and swatch out the eight. But there are also neons, a set of 16 neons in this um, 150 set. So let me just go ahead and show you those there. So here are the neons that are in the uh, 152 set of crayons. So those are some really pretty colors. And then, so apparently, with the eight set that I got at Dollar Tree. I don't have them all. So let's go ahead and just swatch out the eight so we could see what the colors look like because, oh goodness, look at, they're all broken. Oh my gosh, broken crayons do not make me happy. <laughs> So how many broken ones do I have? I have two broken ones. Well, <laughs> that's not happiness at all. Okay, so let's go ahead and just swatch out this eight really quick. And I have just the eight sets left, so this shouldn't take too long. So this one is called Outrageous Orange. Oh, how pretty. I think I had something from the Colors of the World there, so that was not the actual crayon. It just smeared into what was left from the Colors of the World. And this one is called Atomic Tangerine. Oh wait, I just put the one back that I just swatched. So Atomic Tangerine, and I'm just gonna use this tip here to swatch this. Look how pretty that is. Okay, and then this one here is Laser Lemon. So let me lay that one down here. These colors are pretty. And so, gosh, now I wanna see what the other ones look like that are in my actual 16 for my 152 set. This is sky blue. I really want to get the 24 set of these though because like I said earlier, this one's shocking pink. Like I said earlier, you are actually getting extra colors in that because in the 152 set, you only get 16 of the colors. So, Okay, so this one is melon. So if you were to purchase the 120 set of crayons and add on your specialty set, you're actually getting more colors than if you were to just purchase the 152 set that I showed you. Carnation pink, this doesn't really look like it is neon, but okay. <laughs> it's still pretty. These look very neon. And then this one is shamrock. Didn't we see shamrock in another set? Yes, we did. The shamrock is in the Colors of Kindness set. I remember that one, and then they just renamed it. So maybe there are duplicates in some of these sets. So that is the neons. So now we have the pearls, and there's only eight in here. And that last set, man, I should have checked all these before I bought them at the Dollar Tree. If you go to the Dollar Tree and you pick up some of these eight sets, like the one that is exclusive. Oh, look how pretty these are. So these got like, these have like a teal wrapper on them with silver writing. But if you go to the Dollar Tree and you pick these up, make sure you open up the packages and check them so you don't end up with broken crayons like I did. And I really should have done this video live. This would have been a lot of fun to do live. Wouldn't it, would it not have? I think I'm going to go ahead and live premiere this video. I should have done it just straight up live. Okay, so this is hot cocoa. I have not done a live yet, but I'm thinking about it. And I could have totally done this live because nobody's home right now and I would not have been interrupted at all. <laughs> this is black pearl. 
This one is a lavender silk. And then we have Shooting Star. Oh, that's a pretty yellow. This one is Orange Peel. So let's lay that down there, Orange Peel. And then the next one is Apple Orchid. Then we have, what is this? Caribbean Sea. And then we have, what is this? Cloudy Sky. That's a pretty blue. Okay, so that is the Pearl Collection. And honestly, I don't really see anything pearl about these. <laughs> so this is pearl. Oh my gosh, do y'all hear that thunder outside? It is getting ready to totally storm. And of course, it's almost time for my son to get out of school. And I'm glad I'm not the one going to get him. <laughs> because I don't want to get rained on. I don't like driving in the rain. <laughs> okay, so that was the pearl collection. So the next set we're gonna swatch are these pastels, the eight count. And we're gonna go ahead and do those just really quickly and I will read out the names as I go. So this one is Purple Mountain's Majesty. And we'll see just how pastel these are. This one is Sky Blue. I remember seeing Sky Blue somewhere else. Are these the same? I think these are the same. And these were the neons. So you get sky blue in the neon set and then sky blue in the pastel set. I don't know how something can be a neon and a pastel at the same time. <laughs> okay, and then we have canary. Oh, that's a pretty yellow. That's very different. That's definitely pastel. And then this one is spring green. That's really pretty too. And then we have carnation pink. So there is carnation pink and apricot. This one is periwinkle and this one is sea green. Okay, so there are our pastels. So next we have the metallics. And like I said earlier, I've got the eight count from the Dollar Tree, but in my big set here, these over here, are also the metallics. So you get 16 in this set. So these are duplicates and you get an extra eight. But the metallic come in a 24 set. So then if you purchase the 24 set, you would also get a um, an extra eight colors. So I will probably be looking for the 24 set. So let's go ahead and swatch these out. And again, I had, this one was pretty badly broken. So this color here, and oh, and these have even a different wrapping on them. So they've got the very light, like off-white wrapping, and then they've got the um, gold writing on them. And then they just say metallic and have the name here. So this one is steel blue. And I am going to just use the broken one and swatch that out. And we're gonna see if these actually look metallic. So that is the steel blue. And then I've got Robot Canary. That's a pretty color. And then the next one is, where is the color? Okay, so the colors are down on the end in a different place than on the other one. Okay, so Cyber Grape. So we have Alloy, alloy Orange. That's kind of hard to say, tongue twister. <laughs> this one is Deep Space Sparkle. This one is Blast Off Bronze. And they don't really look metallic to me. But this one is Big Dippa Ruby. That's an interesting name. <laughs> and then the last one, oh, this is a pretty color. So if we look at them like they look, let me hold this a little closer to the camera. So if we look at them, they look like they've got glitter in them and they're called metallic. So I don't know, I'm, I'm assuming they're different colors from the glitter set, but this one looks really sparkly and it looks metallic at the same time that it looks like it has glitter in it. So this one is called Illuminating Emerald. That is a really cool name. And then if I look at these though, the glitter is not in them like it was, like if I look at the very tip here, they would be more metallic, I would guess, because they don't have straight up glitter, glitter right down the center like the glitter ones had. So the glitter ones, if you remember when I showed you, had the glitter right down the center. And so they were scratchy when I colored with them and these are not like that. So these are the metallic. And again, this is only eight of the colors. Did I spell that right? No, I put two T's, that's okay. 
y'all have seen me misspell before. <laughs> okay, so we have one last set. Look at these little crayon pieces I have laying all over the place. So these right here, these are the Cosmic Crayons, and these are specific to only the Dollar Tree, and I kind of wonder if these are duplicates or not. Let's go ahead and pull these out. And these are not broken. These are absolutely perfect. So let me see the names on here. This one is Orchid, and I am just going to check something and see. Okay, so I found Orchid in my... 152 set. So these are probably duplicates. What is this one called? This one is Hot Magenta. And let me just check this one so y'all don't go to the Dollar Tree trying to find something that is specific to the Dollar Tree. And they are all duplicates. Okay, so they're not all duplicates because I cannot find this color in the 152 set, which means it's not in the 120 set either. So this is Hot Magenta. That's a really pretty bright pink color. And then this one is Orchid. Let's go ahead and lay that one down. Then we have, what is this, Yellow Orange. That is a really pretty color. It's fairly close to some of these others on here, like it is a little bit close to this one, but it is not exact. And then this one is Pacific Blue. That is really pretty. That's a really bright, vibrant blue. And then we have Jungle Green. That is really pretty. So there's some really pretty colors in here. This one is yellow. I'm pretty sure this is a duplicate because I'm pretty sure in the 120 set or even in the standard eight count, you're probably gonna get just yellow. Sky blue, so this is another sky blue. This is a duplicate and this has been in three of the sets. So if you look at my swatch, you could see it here, here, and here. So some of these are duplicates. So the girl that I talked to at Crayola was not exactly right. This is Wild Strawberry. She told me that these colors were not duplicates because I specifically asked her. So that is not true because this sky blue has been actually repeated here, I think here and here. And that's definitely all the same color. What about on the other swatch? I don't think I remember saying that I had a sky blue anywhere. So yeah, it wasn't in the colors of kindness, the confetti or the glitter, but it was in three of these sets. So we had in the neons, the pastels, and then these cosmic crayons. So that was a lot of fun and that was a lot of swatching. <laughs> I hope y'all enjoyed this video. I'm pretty sure it was quite long. I'm going to try to do this one as a live premiere so we could just kind of have a Crayola crayon party or a crayon party together. <laughs> and we could just chat it up in the live chat. But this was a lot of fun. I hope you enjoyed it. If you check the description box down below, you'll find links down there for my Etsy store as well as my Facebook group and my Patreon if you would like to support me there. I'm also teaching private coloring classes. If you would like to join me for a coloring class, I would love to meet you. I hope you have a great day and I will see you in the next video. Happy coloring. Bye.